hello my flowers and welcome back to another episode of maddie vlogs and does and today we're doing another video of uber eats i have not done one of these videos in a very long time because i was not doing the uber eats in a very long time i've been plotting plotting planning <laughs> towards my own life my own existence for a very long time <laughs> um and i did uber eats the other day so let's see let's go to my earnings oh as you can see first of all um this is the map so this is what the map looks like right now for a sunday it's not even all that red it's not even all that anything honestly truly um and this is probably going to be the last video that i do for uber eats in a long time um because i like i told you guys i am trying to apply and do other um apps other delivery apps at the same time to help out my um, income and i'm still platinum i'm still at a satisfaction of 98 i have not reached um 100 percent of satisfaction as of yet um i have completed 859 deliveries and my earnings um let's look at the details my earnings for the last time that I did any um uh, Uber Eats, I don't know if I told you guys. Um, it was for the for, for the month of October it was ninety six dollars and eighty eight cents. So I'm gonna go back to that because I don't know the last um video that I did or what was the range of time that I did it for. So um I did it for an hour and forty minutes, six trips, and these um since the month of october i want to say that i was either driving or walking and this tuesday i was probably doing um a walker trip um an hour and 40 minutes six trips not that bad i made 39 bucks um then um that friday i made 57 dollars and four cents in four hours and 37 uh, minutes seven trips um, which is bad and this is what i'm trying to say about uber sometimes it happens it's it's good money and sometimes it's not because like tuesday in an hour and 40 minutes i did six trips i want i must have been walking still let's see yeah because everything is like um back to back to back Oh, but I was in surge areas, so that's probably why I was making enough money. Okay, so this is what I want to show you guys. So I was as a walker because the, you know how you can tell you're a walker because the green and the and the red button are very close together in proximity. Um, so I listed myself as a walker. So where you guys see the little lightning bulb and it says the dollar fifty surge, a dollar fifty surge. I got $4.50, but I got a $2 surge. So even though people don't tip you, you want to be in the surge area. And how you know you're in a surge area is when you have the little lightning bulb. Um, or the app is going to tell you that you're in a surge area, which means you're going to get paid um, anywhere from a dollar to $4, sometimes five when it's raining, um, and you're doing your deliveries. Then I have... Um, on Friday, like I said, four hours and 37 minutes, I made seven trips, 42 points, and I made $57.04. Not bad. Um, Because I, I know I'm sure I listed myself as a walker. Um, And I probably did that in the afternoon as opposed to the morning. Sometimes I feel like in the morning time, it's you make more money. So let's go back to other details. And then, so I didn't do it for three weeks straight. As you can see, so from October 18th to November 8th, I wasn't really doing much. So then the next time that I got on Uber Eats, it was the 13th of November. And I was outside for 6 hours and 32 minutes. I made 16 trips and I made $111. This, I will tell you, I was driving. I was in my car listed as a bike. Um, and as you can see, the different stops and areas are further apart and i was in manhattan doing my deliveries on the east side but I, and i was also in like um surge areas of some point a dollar fifty two dollars even when people don't tip you you want to be in the surge areas which i feel like the new york city period is is a surge area um but some areas pay two dollars some areas pay a dollar as you can see um and i listed myself as a biker but I had my car. Um, so in six hours, 32 minutes, 16 trips, I'm going to tell you a little something. I thought I wasn't getting tipped. When you put yourself as a biker and you're in your car, um, you're not going to see your tips coming in right away. It's just going to go right to your wallet. Everything's going to go straight to your wallet. When you list yourself as a, as a walker, it's going to notify you like, oh, somebody tipped you. So make sure that you say thank you. Make sure that you say thank you. You know what I mean? 
um, or you thank that person for giving you the tip. Um, I don't know. It's like a notification that it sends to you. Do I think that this day, $111.93 in six hours and 32 minutes, 16 trips, um, is a lot? No, because um, you waste more gas. Um, but I tried it again, and that was on a Sunday after work. And I made $68.15, eight trips. I was outside for four hours and 43 minutes. Um, and I gained 48 um, points. So I honestly feel like I'm going to, from this point forward, this is probably not going to be the last video. I just feel like it's not going to be the last video um, maybe in a long time. Maybe I'll try it tomorrow after work so that I can prevent myself from being stuck in traffic and doing Uber Eats around my job um, until it takes me to one of the bridges. Like, it'll take me to one of the bridges. I know for a fact. Um, because that's how Uber Eats... Um, that's that's how the alchemy or the algorithm i get not the alchemy but the algorithm of uber eats um works the app it'll take you closer and closer to home the later the la the later the time gets so if you start off at the bottom of manhattan or like wall street area by the time you're done you're gonna be either at midtown or harlem somewhere so the next time that i do my uber eats i'm going to set myself as a walker but i will be in my car as a um, as a biker and I'm sure that I will waste less gas you know I don't have to put $20 in my gas so if you're gonna set yourself as a as a biker in your car and you're doing uber eats in the city um within the time that I that I did the deliveries you're probably gonna have to calculate so I'm gonna let's say um for for example so on Saturday the 13th I have to calculate the fact that I probably wasted a, a good $20 worth of gas in my truck and I have a Jeep Cherokee 2015. So that means I only really made like $80 in six hours. That's how you have to calculate it because you have to make sure that you put your $20 back in your gas. I mean, back in your tank. So then to do it again for another six hours or another day, etc. So I'm going to start setting myself as, as a walker one in once I'm in Manhattan or even in Brooklyn because I know in Brooklyn I've done my um, Uber Eats as a walker and the app is always, always, always hitting. Like no matter what you do, the app is always going to be hitting. Um in Brooklyn. It doesn't matter whether you're in the surge area or not. And it is it's gonna keep you within the vicinity of where you are. It's not gonna take you anywhere. Um, I don't know, maybe in Brooklyn, that's how it works for me, but as it doesn't take you anywhere until it starts getting darker for some reason, like right before the app starts getting, um, black, it'll start taking you t towards either somewhere closer to your home. So that's something really cool to know about, um, Uber Eats. So that's how much I made in two days. And I listed myself again, like I told you guys, um, let me go back. So on November 8th, I mean, the, the week of November 8th for the two days that I did it, $180, and I did it as a driver. Um, in 11 hours. So in 11 hours, is it worth it as a, as setting yourself as a biker? I don't think so. Maybe you guys can go ahead and comment a different opinion, but I personally don't think so because you have to put money in your gas. So out of the 180 I would have to put um, $40 out of that money. In 11 hours, I don't think it's worth it. Um, I think I sh will continue to put, set myself up as a walker when I'm in my car doing Uber Eats. Um, then I will tell you guys also, um, there's a way around the app uh, giving you the distance or giving you the directions as a walker. You can always use the Google Maps app within the app, um, which is usually... Um, oh, sorry. It's not going to be here because I'm not connected. I'm not on. Womp. Okay. Well, maybe... I don't know. Anyway, if I was on the app and I was to hit go and I had like a pickup to do um, listed as a walker... It's going to give you the option to use another app, which is the Google Maps app. And you can set yourself um, as a walker on the app, but drive yourself around. And this way you waste, waste less gas. And I can do, you know, six, four to six pickups in every hour and 30 minutes, which means I can get anywhere between 30 to $60 in every hour and 30 minutes, as opposed to $100 every six hours or every four hours, which is not worth it to me. So I just wanted to give you guys that tip or that heads up and I will see you guys in the next video. Please do not forget to water your life. Like, share, subscribe, comment and tell somebody, everybody about Maddie Vlogs and Does. Bye y'all. <laughs>